पक्ष अनेक अनेक शुभे और अभिनंदन आज के राष्ट्रीय महिला मोर्चा सभा नेत्री भानती श्रीनिवसन जी उनार उपस्थित अपन सामने एक प्रेस मिट हम करते जा प्रेस मिटे उपस्थित आदे प्रदेश साधारण सम्पादिका तथा तो महिला मोर्चार प्रभारी माननीय पपिया दत्त महोदया उपस्थित आशनल कमिटी सेक्रेटरि अश्रिया बैशाल महोदया उपस्थित आदेश प्रदेश स्पोक पार्सन डेपुटी मेयर मनिका दास दत्त महोदया तो आज के सकाल दोपुरे उन्नी आगरतला विमानबंदे आसार पर अलरेडी दोटो कार्यक्रम कमप्लीट कर सबा जान खूब शर्ट समय उनार राज्य आगमन अलरेडी खयरपुर एक विशाल संख्यक जनसभा मिलित होखान नय बनमीपुर मंडल उद्योगे महिला मोर्चार उद्योगे चायर साथ आड्डा एक कार्यक्रम छो से विशाल संख्यक नय बनमीपुर महिला से कार्यक्रम करार पर एपे सामने राष्ट्रीय सभा नेत्री के लिए इसी त्रिपुरार राज्य भारतीय जनता पार्टी सरकार प्रतिष्ठित हार पर जे उन्नयन राज्य महिला देखते पे राज्य महिला जे भाव स्वप्न देखते शुरू कर विषयगू विस्तारित आलोचना रखबें एवं आगामी दुहजार तेईस जो विधानसभा निवाचन से निवाचन एक रूपरेखा से मार्गदर्शन के देवें तो से विषय आलोचना करार्जन सम्मानीय राष्ट्रीय सभा नेत्री मानती श्रीनिवसन मैडम के बोल मैडम अपनी थैंक यू जाना जी सभी मीडियो भैया को मेरा नमस्कार वनकम गुड इवनिंग इट इज माई फर्स्ट विजिट टू द स्टेट ऑफ त्रिपुरा as being the national president it is my first organizational tour to the state of tripura today morning i have reached the state and i have attended two programs on is jan sabha of the assembly speaker ratan chakrabarti ji and also i have inaugurated one program of magila morcha we are having totally 870 Shakti Kendra. Shakti Kendra in our party it is comprising of four to six booths. In each Shakti Kendra, Mahila Morcha is going to have char sate adda. It is like a chai pe charcha program in which today I have inaugurated in one mandal along with the. beneficiaries as well as the common women we had an interaction with them i have asked some of the women who have attended the event how they are feeling about the bjp government in tripura and also i have asked them what the transformation that the women that you are feeling and of course the Karib Kalyan Anna Yojana is most popular scheme that is being implemented here, and almost we could see that more than sixty percent of the population in Tiripura is the beneficiary under that Karib Kalyan Anna Yojana. And one woman who was literally crying, saying that during Corona ka, it is because of the rice and wheat of the Honorable Prime Minister. our family was able to survive and about vaccination and about the social pension scheme in particular 
the amount now they are receiving around 2000 rupees per month and the number of beneficiaries have also been increased and this also the most popular yojana among the women in particular yes apart from that the free education for women in the government colleges it is one of the very important scheme of the state government providing free education for women for their entire life because of the assistance to their education it is going to be changed and around 55000 girl children they have got the bicycle bicycle it is not an instrument for transportation any movement any vehicle for a woman is a wing to their life if they are having the wings they need not depend anybody else on their own they can take that vehicle wherever they want to go at whichever time they would like to travel and the 33% reservation in the government jobs and in particular the 10% reservation in the police force when any women who are seeing any women constable or the police official in the police station they are getting the confidence and the encouragement to tell about their issues and the first women police station has been inaugurated by the honorable chief minister recently in tiripura and various women empowerment schemes being implemented here in the state and as well as the central government sponsored schemes whether it is a portion abhiyan see around 28000 women and children have benefited under the portion abhiyan and because of that the malnutrition has been decreased among the children by 8% and among the women by 3%. And media brothers, you are all knew about the increasing of the sex ratio of a women in this country. So first time after independence, like any developed countries, the India's sex ratio has been increased. It is because of the various initiatives of the Honorable Prime Minister Modi ji and as well as the, the movement he has been created like a selfie with a daughter and giving an opportunity to women in the ministry and as well as at the local body level. And our party is the only political party in India which gives 33% reservation in the organizational position. Even you can see that one of the general secretary of the party is a woman, our Papiya Dattaji. Like a first time in independent India, there are 11 ministers in the cabinet, in the ministry. And for a first citizen of this country, a Adivasi women has been given an opportunity. Considering the basic amenities at the grassroots level to the women and involving the women at the policy making process, our party as well as our Honorable Prime Minister are giving a, a better platform to all the women of this country. Because of that, the, the confidence has been increased among the particularly the, the young women opening up the different services for women and the science sector, research and under the mudra loan, the major beneficiaries are women. Because of that, the self-employment, the entrepreneurial skills of the women have been improved and whatever the amount that the women are getting in the family, it is completely being used for the welfare of the family. That is a very crucial factor for any women empowerment scheme. Under the mudra scheme also, here the state has been in the forefront of giving lot of benefits to them. Under Ujwala Yojana, there are 2.76 lakh women have been provided with the gas connection. And more importantly, nowadays we are all discussing about the crime against women in this state. Because of the stringent action of the state government, the law and order is under the control and as well as 30% of the crime against women have been decreased and one of the reason is the highest percentage of conviction in the state. Those are all the days when we were interacting with the women, they were saying that how the communists under the communist government, the political murders have been happened and how the law and order situation was very bad in, in the state. And we are all preparing ourselves for the coming assembly election. On behalf of Magila Morcha, under the leadership of Jarnaji, 
our Mahila Morcha office bearers as well as the district units are getting activated and every office bearer is being given a specific task of with the outreaching outreach program of Shakti Kendra Chai Pei Charcha kind of a program and as well as interacting with the women beneficiary at the booth level and more importantly while doing this program we are getting the suggestions we are getting their opinion and their problems at the grassroots level and Mahila Morcha is going to consolidate all the opinion or the suggestions or their issues to the state unit while preparing the manifesto for the election we hope and we appeal to the state unit to consider all the Magila issues to address to be addressed in the coming days and and one important thing that uh, the market stalls the 50% reservation for women have been given and per capita income of the state has been significantly improved. Under Pradhan Mandri Avas Yojana, 2.5 lakh citizens of this state have been given houses. And under Aishman Bharat Yojana, it is an access to the better health care facility. A 5 lakh rupees to be given for the entire family under Aishman Bharat. Around 3, 13 lakh citizens have been provided with Aishman Bharat card. And for youth, 11 lakh youth has been provided under the loan under the mudra scheme, PM mudra scheme. Whether it is a central government scheme or the state government scheme, the BJP government in Tiripura is in forefront in implementing and getting the major beneficiaries under the scheme. So, with this I would like to conclude. And if at all you are having any questions, you please, please you can ask that. And we are very much hopeful that in the past, whether it is a five state election before in UP or in Goa or in Manipur, even recently in Gujarat, we have seen that there are large number of women who have supported Bharati Ajanta Party. And slowly women of this country started believing that the BJP only can give them the better future and better environment for their life. So Tiripura is a no exception that Magilas here, it is not only our Magila Morcha unit, I could see that generally the women are so active and vibrant in the state of Tiripura and we expect, we are hopeful that women voters are going to be given, give their vote in favor of Bharatiya Janata Party. Thank you so much. Thank you brothers.